wanted to make a quick video to show you how to transfer your Chase Ultimate Rewards points to Chase's airline and hotel partners. So you log into your Chase account and on the right side you can find your various rewards programs. Click on Ultimate Rewards Points and then it'll prompt you to choose which card you want to view. Now remember in order to transfer points to Chase's partners you'll need to be in a Chase Sapphire Reserve, Chase Sapphire Preferred or Inc. Business Preferred account. So you'll choose the account associated with one of those cards and that'll bring up your Ultimate Rewards Rewards home. Once you get to the Ultimate Rewards home page, you want to find where it says travel. Click the down arrow there and underneath one of the options that pops up is transfer points to partners. That will bring you to the transfer partner page that lists all of Chase's airline and hotel transfer partners. All of these programs transfer one to one. So if you transfer a thousand Chase points, you'll get a thousand points in any of these loyalty programs. Let's pick one of them, British Airways Executive Club. So once you click on it to choose it, you'll have to scroll to the bottom and hit transfer points. If you've never linked this account, you'll need to enter your member number and confirm your member number, but you only have to do that once. Once you've linked up an account like that, it remains saved for the long term. So let's take a look at a different one that I already have linked up. We've transferred to World of Hyatt plenty of times before, so that account is already linked up. So you can click on Hyatt, scroll around, click transfer points, and it'll just have you confirm that the membership number is still correct. And then on the next page, you enter the number of points you want to transfer. Again, they transfer one to one in a minimum increment of a thousand. Let's say you wanted to transfer 5,000 points. It'll show you 5,000 points being deducted from your Ultimate Rewards account and added to Hyatt. You just click the submit button at the bottom. It'll tell you that it takes 72 hours or something like that. But almost all of Chase's transfer partners transfer instantly. In fact, I think Singapore is probably the only one that's not an instant transfer partner. Now, I told you you had to be transferring from a SAP Fire Reserve Preferred or Inc. Business Preferred. But let's say you have points on a card like a Chase Freedom card. All right. And those cannot transfer to partners. You see, there is no place to choose transfer partners. But what you can do is combine those points with your other Chase cards or with one other person in the same household by clicking where it says Rewards Details and Combine Points. Then you'll just choose the two cards through which you want to combine your points. Choose the card that you're going to send them to. In this case, I'd pick the Sapphire Reserve card, and then you can choose the number of points that you'd like to move over to your Sapphire Reserve, because presumably you'd like to transfer them. So let's say I wanted to make an even number of points on the Sapphire Reserve card here, so maybe I would transfer over 130 Ultimate Rewards points to have exactly the 11,000 that I need. It's super simple you just enter the number and then hit submit and the points transfer over instantly in fact if i go back to the sapphire reserve card now you'll see i now have the eleven thousand points that uh, that i topped off there so it's that simple to transfer your chase ultimate rewards points to chase's various airline and hotel partner programs to get great value